and I really wanted to get into detail with the fact that this is what it looks like when you're going through spiritual warfare is God will put you in places and environments that you really don't want to be in or you think that you're getting it for one reason but really whole time it is going to benefit you in that reason but he has you set up for a whole plan because he knows that you're equipped and he knows that you are the perfect candidate for the job and when you get there, they might not even like you because they sense that your energy is about to shift something in the atmosphere. They shift that your energy and your presence alone is so powerful that it's going to expose the things that they've literally been trying to get away with for so long. It's going to expose the enemy inside of them. It's going to expose the fact that they've been walking with demons this whole time, but trying to say that they're not. It's going to expose the fact that the systems that they have are literally the wrong systems to have in place. This is why you've been working on yourself for so long. This is why you have the gifts that you have. This is why you always stand out. And sometimes it feel unfortunate because you walk in and you're like, I don't understand why they treated me so weird, baby. It's because when you walk in, they feel you. <laughs> Yeah, that you think they see you. You think, oh, they not they being jealous of me because I'm pretty and this and that. Baby, it goes far beyond outer beauty. The way that he is setting up everybody's eyes these days, it don't even matter what you look like no more. People are sizing you up from your posture, of your spirit, of your energy. So those who are trying to be vain and trying to still be superficial and act like, oh, it's all about the outer appearance and this and that. Baby, them blinders are off. <laughs> you know why I'm here. Mrs. Get the job done. Mm -hmm. And I can carry the weight. And that's one of the things that they're not going to like about you is that it's so many of them. And it's only one of you. And you can carry the weight that all 10 of them have a hard time with carrying. And here it is, little old you not even giving yourself enough credit to say that it's due, that you literally can carry it. You don't give yourself enough credit for why it is that you actually being put in these environments and put in these rooms. You slay demons, the biggest ones. I ain't talking about the little ones. That's why you got so many. You slay the biggest of demons. This is why you're literally put into these environments. But here it is. You don't even give yourself enough credit. Because you're unaware of what it is that you're actually doing. You're unaware of your own power. You're unaware of the fact that the very things that you have, they actually want to possess. You're unaware of the fact that most of these people don't even like you and don't even really want to be friends with you. They just simply want the powers that you have. And the only way that they can get it is because they know they can't defeat you. If they fight you, they have to be friends with you. Let's really be for real. Get into it, yeah. Make sure you stay prayed up. Make sure you stand protected and make sure you know your value and your worth.